Leaders need to be able to communicate their ideas, their direction, and provide feedback in order to drive the organization forward. And in my view, there are three key elements in stellar communication. Written communication, verbal communication, and nonverbal communication. So let's start with the power of written communication. One of the things that I learned at Procter & Gamble was crafting the perfect one-page memo. It teaches you how to think, how to think clearly, how to think concisely, how to think persuasively. Later in my career, I was fortunate to be in situations where I had to verbally communicate my ideas. Instead of p gs method of moving the business forward with a one-page memo, Pizza Hut moved the business forward with presentations. But the power of presenting and the power of being effective in presenting your ideas is a key leadership component. My time at Nintendo, uh, I became a master in nonverbal communication. And that's because business was done both in Japanese and in English. You know, Mr. Iwata might say something to me in Japanese. It would be translated into English. I would respond in English, but it would be translated back in Japanese. But the translation doesn't have emotion. It doesn't capture a smile or a twinkle of the eye or a frown. You know, all of these nonverbal messages that are being delivered with the commentary. So it taught me to focus on you know, the individual and what they're saying. You know, are they smiling? Are they frowning? What is, what is the nonverbal cues in the message that's being delivered? 